Hello everyone, welcome to the Adorn region. I'm your host Adorn himself. Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Super Mystery Dungeon already in progress. Playlist in the description if you're checking out old episodes. And the question of the day is here, what do you think about what happened on the summit? I'm asking that because we're about to find out what happened on the summit. So, without further ado, let's get going. Here we are, at the summit. Very, uh, rocky. Rocky mountains and all that sort of stuff. Uh, I guess we're hiding behind a rock here. This must be the summit. Of Showdown Mountain. Shh, keep it down. Oops, sorry. I wonder if Entei and whoever is behind this are already here? I can't tell. First, let's get a handle on the situation. We'll be in trouble if they find us first, so we have to be careful. Stay low and keep moving. Alright. Bob and weave. Boom. Rush behind the rocks here. And then rush behind these rocks here. Wait for it. Rush behind those rocks here. Uh, whoa. What? What's wrong? I see it. Yeah! That's not good. Uh, looks like Entei has already been stonified. A Pokemon that's been turned to stone. Could this be Entei? Yep, no doubt about it. But how? I mean, it's Entei we're talking about here. Looks like a showdown with whoever's behind this is already over. I don't sense anybody else around. Looks like whoever turned Entei to stone is already gone. Beep, 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 beep. Uh, hello? It's the expedition gadget. Everyone took out their expedition gadgets. Hello. Come in. Is anyone there? No, it's Dedene. I'm so glad I got a hold of you. What's going on over there? Dedene, can you hear me? It's Mawile. Actually, it's, uh, yeah, Bad Sitch. Uh-huh. Is that so? Even Entei got turned to stone. Yeah. He unfortunately didn't make it in time. Dedene, what about the chief? Oh, Bunnelby. Good work out there. When I contacted him a minute ago, he said he was approaching the summit. I think he should arrive shortly. And here I am. All timed. Thank you for your efforts, everyone. I could hear your conversation with Dedene. I believe I have a rough understanding of what took place. It seems that we were too late. My, my, my. Because you kept you kept getting us lost, Chief. Uh, you shouldn't be that silly. Anyway, even one as powerful as Entei has been turned to stone, as you can see. Our enemy appears to be quite the formidable Pokemon. Yes, this will be a troublesome foe. Let's discuss it more fully after we return to Lively Town. Alright. And we head to Lively Town. We're back home. Panic. Oh, boy. Mm. Crocodile? Yeah. He was hiding behind that rocky cliff near the summit. I told him to stay where he was, but he ran off anyway. He's such a flagrant fatty. I got it. Crocodile's the culprit. He just has to be. So all we have to do is arrest Crocodile and then be case closed. Done to eat. We'll be able to eat our meals in peace again, of course. I Aha. I mean, but how, though? Swirlix, you don't seem to be too concerned when you're eating even now. It's true that Crocodile's wicked strong. And he is a notorious crook. He certainly would think nothing of turning a Pokemon to stone, but I've never heard anything at all about Crocodile having the power to turn things to stone. Yeah, that's the thing that's tripping us up here. Even if he did that kind of power, I think he'd be using it for something worse. Maybe he's just shy, so he doesn't want to use his powers in front of others? Anyway, none of this changes the fact that Crocodile is suspicious. I at least know that. I am a genius, after all. Uh, sure. Hmm. And, and for us? I don't know whether or not Crocodile is behind this, but let's set that aside for now. After Crocodile ran off, I found a stone tablet. A stone tablet, you say? Yeah, a stone tablet with ancient foot -like, uh, footprint-like writing on it. I plan to shut myself in my room and investigate this. Maybe be able to teach us something about these incidents. I see. Understood. Mawile, I will leave the deciphering of the stone tablet to you. I think we had also better track down Crocodile. Weasel, Arjun, can I trust you to take care of that tomorrow? Roger that. Understood. The rest of you may proceed with your work as usual. Very well then. Dismissed. Up to. Uh, we'll save and continue. Woo, it's a four minute episode or something like that. Save complete. The next morning, we wake up. Today's another day of work. Give it your all. Let's go. As everyone heads out to do their thing. Let's see. It's another fine day for exploring, though I'd rather be chasing that Krugadal down if I'm being honest. Yeah. I get that feeling. Uh, nevertheless, though, we must continue with our efforts to be the best, the very best, like no one ever was. Swirlix, Crocodile's the one behind it all, I'm sure, there's no doubt about it. Mawile, any updates? I'm working on deciphering the ancient text on that stone tablet, but it is not easy. I'd hope to finish it by the end of today, but that's looking difficult now. Oh, well, that's not great. Today, if you're looking for Archon and Blizzard, I think they already left to find Crocodile. That won't be the hard part. The hard, real hard part comes after we catch him. What if we do? Crocodile really is the one behind all this. Yeah, we just try to close our eyes or something. 
Leave Crocodile up to Archon and Buizel. You two just keep working on your regular work for the Expedition Society. Yep, 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 yep. Jirachi? What kind of skill could turn another Pokemon into stone? How is it even possible? Alright, this must be where genius uh, Jirachi comes out, because Jirachi is thinking about this hard. Alright, uh, that looks like something about to happen, so I'm going to avoid that real quick. Entei was really strong, wasn't he? But even he was not strong enough. What kind of form do you think a Pokemon takes when it turns into stone? I've seen a few. It's not great. What are you supposed to going after legendary Pokemon? A valid question. Hey, want to play Mudsport? That's irrelevant. Uh, Dodu Doduo, if I stop moving, I start to feel uneasy, so I've decided to keep running. If that works for you. They say it's just legendary Pokemon being targeted recently, but that doesn't mean that we should let our guards down. True, true. Duck what? Let me tell you about my world travels. Travel can be trouble, but I won't duck. I've heard a rumor that Entei was turned to stone, but is there any truth to it? Uh, I'm afraid to say that's... It's true. It's so true. Uh, uh, show me what you want to eat. Oh, that's not relevant. Um, I feel like we might be overreacting a bit. In actual fact, nothing has happened in their town so far. Um, yes, but it's very close. Lively Town has always been such a safe place until now. Why did that have to change right when I got here? Alright, I'm gonna go down here just for giggles. Nothing's over here. Alright, let's confront Croc Rock here. Archon, what's up? You wanna know where Mr. Crocodile is? Like I know. Don't you think I'd be right there with them if I did? He just up and disappeared. Come on, out with the truth. Just tell us. It's more important that you know. Then you know. Yada yada yada. Loud screams. He's not in the cafe? It looks like a no. Though there is an Ornberry. Hmm. Looks like Crocodile has disappeared. Much to the shock of, uh, Crocorock. Yeah. I can tell the difference. I know that. Oh my gosh, there's so many fresh apples here. Uh, we're going to make bank. Let's see, don't need that, that. I'm going to hold off. Actually, I'll keep those. All right, we'll store this. I'm going to hold on to the rocks for now. Hello. I would like to sell stuff. Every single apple that is fresh. Here you go, 800 bucks. I like the idea of like fresh apples being worth more. Uh, and that is enough for us to get some serious... Oh, wait, no, I gotta open some boxes. Serious amount of money, though. Here we go. Let's open the nifty box. Here we go. Ba-boom. Zinc. And the pretty box. It's got some iron in it. Cool. I gotta use those eventually, but for now, I'm just holding on to them for a rainy day. That may or may not exist. Uh, we'll deposit what remaining cash we've got and deposit those items that we just picked up. Cool. Let's check a look at missions. See if anything new has popped up. Nothing new here. That's unfortunate because that means we got to start taking on some more difficult tasks. Um, speaking of difficult tasks, what should we do? Uh, rescue... That seems to work for me. It doesn't look like that's a hard one. Uh, let's rescue Spritzy on the small sand dune in the air continent. So let's go there. So it really has happened. Entei was really turned to stone. That doesn't answer the question why anyone would come to target him. That's a valid question. You're just as confused. Let's go to the air continent, though, and see if we can uh, make some progress. Do some mission. Found a roll call orb. That's cool. Um, but I think I just realized I never used the gin bottle from a couple episodes ago, and I think it has disappeared. So you got to pick it up and use it. Uh, otherwise it doesn't do anything. That makes sense. All right, let's do this. Uh, we want to go to the small sand dune. Uh, the rescue mission there, it's going to be okay. Presumably. Let's see, I'm going to go here, member selection, we'll swap out Alakazam. Let's see, it's a sand dune, right? So, Swana's back, let's use Swana. I, I'm, I know I'm copying some of the same folks over and over again, but just trying to zoom through this. Alright, there seems to be someone ahead, I think this is where Spritzy is. Oh, and they're right there, that's great. Uh, I don't want to necessarily deal with the, the Honage and the Golem, but, you know, we'll work with what we got here. Oh, gosh. It just demolished me. Took recoil damage as well. I'm gonna just save Spritzy. Sorry, son, for the, uh, the knockout blow there. 
Uh, good job saving me. Now let us go back. Yes, we shall. Because sun is not feeling so hot right now. Alright, through the spritzy connection here. Do we get Togetic? No, we don't. Okay. Uh, let's exit. Yep, we can. We shall. I'm not dealing with, you know, swords. Golem previously used magnitude as well, and I did not like that. Alright, meanwhile, the town. Sorry to keep y'all waiting. Dinner's ready. Oh, looks like some folks are missing. Huh? Where are Archie and Weasel? They aren't back from their expedition to find Krugadal yet. Mawile well, isn't, he, isn't here either, she is she. You still shut up in her room. Seems like it's taking her some time to decipher that ancient writing. Well, shall we go ahead and eat? Uh, what? Aren't you gonna wait? But I'm hungry. It's alright, isn't it, Chief? Hmm. Yeah, I'm finished. What? <laughs> alright, let's do this. Let's eat. We're back. Hey, what's up? Weasel, Archon, I'm glad you made it. Oh, time for dinner, huh? But first, Chief, we've been out looking for Krugadile. He doesn't seem to be anywhere around here, so it took us a while. We've been and checked out Krugadile's place, too. We found a half-written morning letter. Well, well, well. A Krugadile's place? A half-written morning letter? So that means Krugadile was the one writing those warnings, right? Was Krugadile there? No, he wasn't. It was deserted. We have no idea where he could have gone to. So it looks like Krugadile really is the one behind all this. Yeah, we need to find him as soon as possible. Sorry to keep y'all waiting. Hey, it's Mawile. What's up? Mawile! I finished deciphering the stone tablet. What did it say? It was a record of the incidents of Pokemon being turned to stone. A turned to stone, you say? Yeah. Although I can't claim to have every de I de deciphered every last bit of it, Pokemon being turned to stone has apparently been happening for some time. That's not good. It seems there are more detailed accounts in the prehistoric ruins to the east. Oh, that's interesting. The prehistoric ruins to the east. Yeah, that's not great. Not ideal. Maybe we can find out how Pokemon are being destroyed if we go check it out. That's not all. There's a chance. We may be able to find out how to reverse the process. Ooh, that's good. To turn those Pokemon back from stone? I see. The prehistoric ruins, you say. Seems that we're going to be quite busy. However... Grr. Is that someone's stomach growling? Oh boy. Again. Well, 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 everyone. It seems we have no choice. Yeah, Chief, I can see you drooling. <laughs> We can't take an empty stomach lightly, you know, can we, did I? We can't do anything when your belly's empty after all. So, get around the table. We're going to be quite busy, but before that, let's eat. Munch, munch, choo, choo, snuffle, slurp, or whatever the equivalent is. I think it was louder that time. Um, like the, the sound effects. Anyway, the prehistoric ruins. To the east, according to Mawile, if we go there, we might be able to turn Pokemon back from stone. Poor old Entei. Latios and Latias. It sure would make me happy if they weren't stone anymore. While we're standing here talking, even more Pokemon could be getting turned to stone. It would be huge if we found some way to turn them back. Alright, let's do this. It's off to the prehistoric ruins tomorrow. At least that's, uh, that's uh, at least I think that's what's going to happen. Let's go to bed early to get rested up for tomorrow. Yes, yes indeed. Alright, and that is a good place to end this episode here. A little bit of adventuring, a little bit of shenaniganing. Uh, and a potential way to reverse the stone process, which will make things significantly easier for everybody around. Thank you, everyone, for listening, watching, and supporting in any way, shape, or form that you do. And until next time, we go save the day, maybe. Till then, take care.